Hey guys, it's your girl London and I am back with another video. And in today's video, I'll be using the main choice, Killer Curls and Brutal Bounce. So stay tuned for this twist out tutorial. So first off, I'm gonna put a towel on me because I have to wet my hair. As you can see, my hair is so dry and it's been in a ponytail for the last two or three days. <laughs> I ain't did nothing to it, y'all. Okay, so I'm working with this little section right here in the back. Now it said start on saturated hair, so I'm making sure I wet this thing up. And I will be putting a, not a lot, but I do wanna put a little bit of oil on my hair because like I said, I didn't put any oil on my hair when I washed it a few days ago. So I wanna make sure my hair has some oil on there. At least a little bit. And I am gonna go in with my Denman brush. <laughs> I think that's the funny bone, but it don't be funny at all, man. Oh my goodness. Okay, so I'm gonna go in with my dimming brush and I'm just brushing my hair down. The new year, y'all, I'm gonna be all about my hair for real, y'all. Like, I want a huge afro and stuff like that. So I kinda wanna be like one of those people that be like doing their hair every week or something like that because i don't do my hair every week <laughs> so i definitely would like to do that okay so all i have is some water and a little bit of oil and boom curls is popping a little bit back there curls is cute back there so this was 16.99 so i really hope that it's living up to expectations because $16.99 is a lot to spend on a hair product when you can get something for $7.99 and it could do the same thing. So I'm really hoping that this leave my twist out looking amazing because if not, I'ma just be very upset that I spent $17 on this one product. So I am putting it all in my hair. And y'all know I have to part this because I am gonna be two strand twisting my hair oh i mean i ain't even did nothing and this stuff is like look i didn't even do nothing wow okay i'm, I'm already a little excited y'all okay so y'all know how to do two strand twist you're gonna part it into two twist one end twist the other end and then you're gonna connect it And I don't want this too tight to my roots, y'all. Okay, so I'm applying the yellow side of this main choice product. And I'm gonna spray a little more water on my ends because they was a little dry. Y'all like, did it? Oh no, nah. I could have just left this how it was because <laughs> the curls is coming. Oh, I can't wait to see this, y'all. Oh, once it's dry and everything. So I hope everybody had a good Christmas. I've been so busy, y'all, but I did miss y'all. I actually felt like some type of way because I didn't post on Friday. I'm so sorry, y'all, but just with Christmas and just with my kids, you know, I just didn't have, I wasn't able to post the videos that I wanted to post. So I do apologize for that, y'all. I hope that everybody is ready for the new year. Y'all got y'all vision boards together or y'all journals, y'all weekly planners for 2021 because I really want everybody to have a great 2021, like no matter what. You deserve to have a good 2021. And look, just that quick, y'all, we we finished it. Like, well, we ain't finished. You know, we gotta take them loose. <laughs> but we 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 partially there. Okay, so these are my little dreadlocks. 
I'm just playing y'all. So these are my little twists. So I'm gonna let them dry overnight. I feel like if I let them sit overnight, then I should get my best results. So that's what I'm gonna do. So it's the next morning, y'all, and I'm about to go ahead and take out my twist, and I'm gonna be using my coconut oil and a little bit of black castor oil. So this is how it looks taken out. Now y'all gotta remember it's not poofy or bigger like it sh you know usually would be, and that's because I am still trying to you know get my curls to revert back from when I flat ironed it some weeks ago. So that's why. So it's just wavy right now, which I love. I love when my hair is like this because it's easier for me to maintain. But when I'm doing styles like this, I need my poofy hair. So I guess that doesn't help. <laughs> Taking these out, like I said, just use your little coconut oil, castor oil. Yeah, I'm thinking about dyeing my hair. I don't know what color I'm gonna do yet, but I mean, it's a new year. I'm feeling brand new, y'all. <laughs> I kind of want to just have some fun with my hair. So therefore, I'm thinking about definitely dyeing it. Uh, Probably like, I don't know what color. Y'all tell me what color y'all think would be good for me to dye my hair. I don't know if I should get bangs either, y'all. I'm still trying to decide. So, and don't worry, I will make a video so you guys could see everything. <laughs> It'll be my first time dyeing my hair myself. So, like a color. I'm not trying to bleach my hair uh, because bleach doesn't like me and I've already established that a long time ago. So I'm not trying to do no bleach. I'm just trying to do like a natural dye or whatever. So using my main choice, I am going in with the edge control side of that. And it smells so good, y'all. So, so good. And I'm just going to slick down my edges before I start styling my hair, y'all. Okay. I mean, y'all can see from the camera how this laying down. Like, I don't even got to... Ex, you know, I don't even gotta express that to y'all. It's our y'all already know. Like, look how it's laying down my hair. And that's the type of edge control I like. I like when it's very pasty, kind of like tacky, because I know that it's gonna dry good. So yeah, I'm gonna let it dry. I actually was trying this new product, y'all. It's called Wild Wild Hair Growth. I'll let y'all know how that grows on my hair, but I've been putting it like, you know, all throughout my hair. We'll see if it, you know, give me some inches. <laughs> and I also want to do that, um, the, the water and rice thing. Yeah, I also want to do that water and rice method on your hair to like stretch it. But I just feel like, oh my, it, the rice is going to be sucking my hair so much. Once my curls revert back, that might be that might be a process. I'm gonna have to have my husband help me because who gonna how, how I'm gonna see the back, sis. Now we're gonna go ahead and stretch the hair out using a wide two comb. Like I said, I didn't have a afro pick, whatever it's called, a pick. So I'm gonna be using my wide two comb that has been with me through the struggle <laughs> for as long as I can remember. And I'm just gonna just pick out my roots a little. And this is just giving your hair a little more volume, y'all. I think I'm gonna keep my hair, I guess I can keep it this way because sometimes I like to put me a little side swoop, but I guess this is okay. And like I said, you don't wanna go, you don't wanna go all the way through your hair. You just wanna like lift it a little and just at the roots, cause then you gonna mess up the curl pattern that you just took your time on doing. Yeah, I think this would have been easier if I had to pick y'all, but I ain't gonna complain, that's okay. Okay, so this is how it looks so far. <laughs> now I'm gonna go in with a little more oil and I'm gonna really separate my hair. 
like if I feel like it's too thick I'm gonna separate it like this I feel like it's too thick so I am going to just separate it into two and that's gonna just you know make my hair a little bigger so anywhere I feel like it could be separated I'm gonna separate this could be one of the styles that y'all wear y'all could wear it behind the ear if you want you could actually pin it with a bobby pin I'll show y'all how that looks real quick. What you wanna do is just twist your hair a little bit. This is just to really like lay my hair down behind my ear. So it'll be more like this type of style if I did a behind the ear, which is really my preference. That's what I go to all the time. I like behind the hair, behind the hair. I like behind the ear styles. <laughs> Okay guys, so this is the final look. I hope you guys enjoyed this twist out tutorial that I did using the main choice. This is the product. It is the Killer Curls and Brutal Bounce. It was worth the $16.99 y'all. I really do like how it makes my hair feel. Don't forget to give your girl a thumbs up for this video and like always subscribe to my channel for more content like this. Until next time, treasure your family, treasure your time, and most importantly, treasure yourself. Happy New Year's!